Costa. <laughs> hearing about a hypnotist that had come to town where I lived. So I finally built up the courage to ask my girlfriend at the time if she would let me hypnotize her. I said, hey, I've got this script. Can I try it? And all of a sudden you realize, oh, I was supposed to turn like a mile ago. Has that happened to anybody? Something happens, right? The light changes. You come back to it. Oh, the light changes. That's what people think hypnosis is. Mind control. Like I'm going to do something and you're going to give me your pin number. If it was that easy, I would not be here. I'm going to make a circle like that. Hold your right hand out like this. And imagine that we're putting a little pebble. Count to three, and I'm going to snap my fingers like this. Getting somebody in and out of hypnosis is really easy, but it's what you do with them when they're in the state that actually makes the difference. Yeah, I like to leave people a little bit better than I found them <laughs> when I can. You know, while I have the hood up, I might as well <laughs> turn a few wrenches, you know, and like heavier and heavier. Now imagine that on the other hand, on your wrist, we have tied a little string. Maybe you, sir, first. Give a big round of applause. Nice to see you, sir. Here you go, just stand on the stand. 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 Here you go, Five, four, three, two, one. Let yourself roll up with your legs from beneath you. One. Please help me, Darcy. Take this one. Do me a favor, Darcy. Look at that one spot up there. Sleep. That's right, all the way down, drifting into the relax. That's right, okay. That's me, come up. People just always get in trouble for this. <laughs> right? So, I guess I'll go all the way down. I got you, I got you. All the way down. You can just relax, drifting. Five, four, three, two, one. Press down. Look up right here. Sleep. Put yourself all the way down. <laughs> Drift. Drift. Deeper. Deeper. Relax. All the way down. All the way down. Mr. Wolf, give me your hand. Ready? Drift. Relax. There you go. That's right. Then for relaxing. Check it out, Will. Hypnotic ball. You see it? Are you ready? Nice, drifting deeper, deeper. Thank you. All right, everybody give her a big round of applause. No matter what anybody says, your name is going to be John. But you will be unable to talk. You will feel as if your mouth is completely full of marbles and you can't vocalize a word. Let's introduce ourselves to the audience. What's your name? John. What's her name? I know her by Darcy Doodle. Darcy Doodle. What do you think of that? That's a stupid name. <laughs> what should the name be? What's the name? What do you think she should call it? John. <laughs> John? So take a look at that. Is that your ID? It is. And what does it say? It says Hudson Darcy Ann. Is that your name? No. <laughs> Marbles in your mouth, sir. What's your name? <laughs> <laughs> now, every time you try to speak, your tongue just hangs out like a long tongue. You can't let you talk. What do you do for a living, Will? I'm a bad. You know what? I'm a bad. Bad. I'm going to send your name out into the distance like that. Yeah, so imagine that it's right here. And then imagine you're going so far away that you can't see, you can't remember. What's your name? I'm looking for it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see it. I don't know. <laughs> now watch. It's really hard. It's gonna boomerang way out there in the distance and it's gonna come right back. Oh, there it is. Right Darcy. over here. Darcy. Darcy. <laughs> Give him a big round of applause. I wanna introduce you to a friend of mine. 
You feel what the doll feels, you will see what the doll sees, you will hear what the doll hears. <laughs> Drum girl wave. <laughs> Do you feel the warmth? Look at the light. Sleep. First thing, the last thing. All the way down. Is becoming erased from your mind. So what happened to your shoe, man? Oh, that's a good question. That is a good question, man. No, I left the house with it this time. <laughs> but get up and maybe look for it, see if you find it. It would be really good to get it before the show is over. <laughs> Nothing will? I mean, there's so many, so many places. <laughs> well, do you think you left it back in your chair or something? Uh, that's possible. <laughs> well, what happened? What, did you find your shoe? No, I feel like you might have taken it though. <laughs> he come here with his shoe on? I don't know. You don't you don't remember? I mean, he probably didn't look at my feet. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that would have been pretty easy to tell though. Like that, I would tell my friend, "Where's your shoe?" Uh, <laughs> she's got her shoe. Doesn't look at me. And tell me, where is your shoe? Where is your <laughs> shoe, Will? I mean, I don't know. You can tell me. When I touch you on the forehead next, you're going to immediately realize where your shoe is. <laughs> well being, of course, anyone else can participate if you like. Imagine, if you will, right now, we can be instantly filled up with the motivation. When I get to five, you'll be fully refreshed, relaxed, alert. Jump out of your chair and excitedly tell people, this is the best hypnosis show you've ever seen. Applause for our Thank you so much, guys. Very, very good job. Thank you so much, Will. Hypnosis show. This is the best hypnosis show ever. <laughs> As I said, hypnosis is very experimental. Yes, this is <laughs> yeah. And again, I want to thank the Lost for hosting. And I want to especially thank the uh, volunteers that came up here and helped us have a great show.